Hey guys, we today gamer here, and this is going to be a short video of an epic desktop that I found while browsing on the internet. As you can see, it looks really damn epic. Um, I've had something similar to this once, but it's, it was pretty much just black and white, but this is actually, you know, it looks really cool. And all these are widgets, actually, besides the icons, of course. Anyway, what you got to do is you want to just download this image that I will link, and it's right here. And, you know, just right-click it. Uh... I'll show you in, in my downloads. Right click it and then just uh, set as desktop background. Uh, make sure you can you know stretch it out. But everything on here is looks really, really, really cool. I'll give it that. Okay, there we go. It wasn't full. Anyway, um, what you can do is, of course, you can arrange your icons um, in the rows on the shelves, obviously. But to do this properly, right click view and un uncheck align icons to grid because that will make it like snap to grid every time you move them once you do that just you know uh, change the layout put your recycling in like wherever you want I, I like to put it right here because that's what I have it on my desk um, I, my trash can then the computer monitor you know leave everything there I believe you can resize everything too if I'm not mistaken you, know, you can resize stuff too but there's really no need to anyway then you know arrange the icons on the shelf however you you know, really want. I really don't, don't care how you arrange them. And as for all these widgets, if you right click in Windows 7 at least and click on gadgets, it'll give you a list of all the ones you have installed. And you can click on get more gadgets online and it will bring you to here. Now just you no know, fuck it. I have it yeah, I can have it open here as you can probably tell. Anyway just you know browse for the ones you like. I got the CPU meter which is in the top right on this clipboard right there. Um the calendar is a default one, just make sure you click on larger view. And then we have, um, I have this for Windows Media Player, because I like Windows Media Player. And this for weather, which I'm probably going to blur out, because I don't want people seeing where I live. <laughs> and then, you know, you can add icons to this, whatever you want to do. It just it looks really, really, really cool. And it's something, you know, definitely uh, to get away from the standard bleak look of just a desktop with a million icons. So, you know, plus 10 to this, if you want to give it a go, then go ahead.